நமஸ்காரம் திருக்கோளூர் பெண்பிள்ளை ரகசியம் டென் முதலடியை பெற்றேனோ அகலியையை போலே டிட் ஐ கெட் லார்ட்ஸ் டிவைன் ஃபீட் ஆஸ் லைக் அகல்யா திருக்கோளூர் பெண்பிள்ளை ஸ்டார்டட் டெல்லிங் திஸ் ராமாயணா ஸ்டோரி டூ ஸ்ரீ ராமானுஜா அண்ட் ஹிஸ் சிஷ்யாஸ் முதலடி மீன்ஸ் த லார்ட்ஸ் டிவைன் ஃபீட் கௌதம மகரிஷி அண்ட் இஸ் பியூட்டிஃபுல் ஒய்ஃப் அகல்யா ஸ்டேட் இன்சைட் அ ஆஷ்ரம் in a big forest agalya's beauty charm intelligence and her service to her husband were well known to all she was prized even by devas hearing about her great beauty lord indra attracted with her seeing her beauty one day in the banks of the river he fell for her beauty one day gautama magarishi went to river to take shower At that time, Lord Indra, taking the form of Gautama Magarishi, and approached Agalya. She also allowed herself to be used by him. But before Indra could leave, Gautama Magarishi came back. He saw Indra disguised as him, along with his wife. He got angry and cursed Indra that he would lose his masculinity. He then turned to his wife. and cursed agalya to turn into a stone along with this ashram dust and ashes after hearing the words of her husband agalya fell on her husband's feet and begged for mercy for that gautama magarishi said curse given is given you know that consider this as a penance to purify your soul perform this penance for 1000 years consuming only the air chant the name of lord shriman narayana shriman narayana will be born as shri rama and he will be brought here by sage vishwamitra by the touch of his divine feet your curse will be removed and then you can join with me after telling all these words gautama magarishi left the place after 1000 years sage vishwamitra was accompanied by shri rama and lakshmana On their way to Mithila, Sage Vishwamitra brought them to Sage Gautama Ashram location, which has now turned into a dust. By the touch of Lord Rama's feet, Agalya's curse was relieved. Sage Vishwamitra then explained the story of Agalya to Sri Rama and Lakshmana. In the meantime, Sage Gautama Magarishi also came there and accepted his wife. After telling this story, Thirukolur Penpillai asked Shri Ramanuja, Did I have the great fortune of gaining the touch of Lord's divine feet like Agalya did? I am not at all deserved to be in this Thirukolur town. I want to leave from here. After hearing this, Shri Ramanuja said, Your stories are really interesting. Do you have any other stories like this? For that, Thirukolur Penpillai said, I have so many stories. She started telling the next story. We will see the next story in the next video. What we can learn from this story? Like Agalya, we also need to chant the names of Sriman Narayana to seek his blessings. Sri Rama Rama Rame Thirame Rame Mano Rame சகசிரணாம தத்துள்யம் ராமநாமவராணனே